talk about the visual pages in Salesforce you go to setup in quick find box you type visual force pages you end up here you can see the existing visual force pages I have none here you can create visual uh, force pages from developer console um, pages uh, I have nothing here these are the page component is a section of a page that you can embed in other um, uh, visual force pages so in developer console how to create a uh, visual force pages click new and then visual force page test so this so you have um, markup uh, apex page you embed your uh, code uh, markup code within that here the, this is a blank page you can use the visual F developer studio to create a visual force page or you can create new visual force page uh, is a let's see uh, test so I create a new visual force page I want to make it available in lightning experience experience build and mobile app require CFR prediction I don't want to um, I'll leave it blank for now version settings in the version 62 click say you can create a visual for page this way or develop a console um, visual for pages are the top level container for custom apps building built with visual force create visual for pages by adding visual components standard or custom static HTML markup CSS style and JavaScript to the page uh, technically the visual for pages are getting obsolete uh, it's being replaced right now uh, lightning web components uh, so which has it's powerful fast and more features so if you don't create a new visual for page you create a new lightning components lightning web components so it's a component based development it's uh, you're better off with the lightning web components than with visual force pages in terms of performance support um, and future enhancement by Salesforce uh, Salesforce start stop doing f uh, adding new features to visual force pages their focus is lightning web components so this is all about uh, visual force pages in Salesforce.